Well then, um, it looks like there's a new program that was almost implemented, but then kind of withdrawn for now. Um, it's basically these this program where you can r rent almost a cup for 300 won, which is, I don't know, I don't know like 28 cents in America. Um, and at the end of drinking, you can return that and get your 300 won returned. Mm -hmm. um, it's a very easy um, process. Mm -hmm. All you have to do is do a couple scanning, a little machine, and everything is perfect. Uh, you can do it within a minute. I've actually had direct experience. Oh, really? Yes, which I'll talk about in a second, I'm mm -hmm. sure. Um, but yeah, so uh, it seems pretty easy, but there are people who kind of oppose this. Mm -hmm. They say that it's a burden, it's a hassle. Um, advocates will say like it's good for the environment, but these people just, they, they're not seeing the benefit and cost ratio being worth it mm -hmm. in the end. So it's still to be seen whether this uh, plan will be implemented or not in the future. Mm -hmm. You say you've had some first-hand experience of mm -hmm. this. So um, what do you think of this plan and is it practical? Yeah. Absolutely not. Uh, okay. <laughs> yes. I thought you were going to say something. You thought it was going to be positive, <laughs> yeah. huh? Um, so I will say this. If you're talking about practical as in focusing on an individual's life, it is not practical. Mm -hmm. You have to go out of your way. I ended up keeping the cups because it was so <laughs> impractical. Um, uh, you end up going out of your way. You have to return it to the actual store or a store with a machine in there. So if you do want to go outside and drink it, let's mm -hmm. say on the road, mm -hmm. you're going to have this cup in your hand and you're not going to know where to put it back. Uh, um, you can't put it in the nearest recycling bin, obviously. Mm -hmm. You have to bring it home or find a kiosk to return it to. Mm -hmm. uh, it takes time out of your day and it takes money out of your wallet um, if you don't return it. And uh, it's a hassle. It, it really is. Mm -hmm. However, if you look at it from an environmental aspect, it is a very, I think, practical and good uh, plan. Mm -hmm. Uh, even though it does make a lot of plastic waste at the initial point, the whole program for that recycling or now you have a cup that you use at home um, is hopefully in the long term or in the long run going to be worth it. Mm -hmm. However, I don't think this is going to catch on because why do you get cups to take out? You get them for the convenience. Yes, People yeah. want convenience. That's mm -hmm. the reason why we have a waste problem in the first place. Mm -hmm. And until the mindset of convenience changes, mm -hmm. this thing's not going to work. Yeah. I think, yeah, if you've walked into a coffee shop yeah. and you either haven't got or have forgotten your tumbler, mm -hmm. you're not going to spend the extra minutes to come back if, when you could just go home and get your tumbler if you yeah. had the time. <laughs> yeah. So, And then you're left with a cup, like I have two cups at home, mm -hmm. and I'm like, someday I'm going to throw these away. <laughs> these plastic cups are going to be in the landfill. Mm -hmm. So it's like... Is it too yeah. late now? You cannot return them to the scheme. Um, I believe there was a barcode you had to scan. Ah. Those are long gone. I see. Yeah. Um, I could maybe possibly think about it, but... Mm -hmm. I haven't, again, it's a hassle. And there's only, I think, one store in Korea that does oh, this. So I'm never going back there. Uh, yeah. If it had been maybe a Starbucks thing where there's like one on every corner, it, it was might have been. Tech, it was a Starbucks, but only one Starbucks oh. in Korea. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. They didn't think that through. So you would think that this is kind of a big hassle too. Mm, totally. Mm -hmm. I can't, I, again, it took me ages to get into the habit of keeping my tumbler with me. Mm -hmm. I always kept forgetting it, but now I'm in the habit. Mm -hmm. It seems easy. Every morning, that thing is just in my bag. So whenever I go into the coffee shop, yeah. I just fill it up. Yeah. Get yeah. into the habit. It's hard, but you can do it, man. And that's, it's actually more convenient than these plastic cups. Yeah. It yeah. is. Mm -hmm. yeah, like with my backpack, there's a little pocket on the side. You just stick it there. And I can literally reach behind, grab it. There's my cup. Mm -hmm. So like, you know, I, it is more convenient and easier. If you have nothing, then of course, a pla uh, uh, takeout cup the paper ones are going to be best. Well, for now, the government is doing a little grace period where they're kind of postponing the whole plan. Um, and the grace period is for the, the companies to actually implement this plan. Mm -hmm. But since it's been postponed, that grace period is also indefinite. Mm -hmm. uh, so until that day, let's go ahead and take a look at the vocabulary and learn all about this because we might need to use it pretty soon. Join the club. Join the club. Catch.
Catch. Hassle. Hassle. Tally. Tally. Grace period. Grace period.